today is the day. guys today is the day today is the freaking day we are moving away i'm actually just gonna stand up and get ready because i'm so excited to just sit down i already have on my outfit y'all can't really see it but i'll show y'all in just a second basically if you're new here i have been wanting to move out for about a year now i dropped out of college around this time last year and you know when i was in college i did realize that i really liked my independence and i just liked being off on my own so when i figured that college wasn't for me and i came back home it was like chaos but not like extremely bad chaos it was just like I realized that I just like being on my own like I like my peace so when I got down here I started doing nails and stuff to help me save up my money in order for me to move out and now is the time I'll probably do like a video on how I did save up to get ready to move but it was a journey and I'm so grateful so thankful I'm so proud of myself I feel so blessed right now to be able to do this like this is amazing this is a new chapter and you guys are going to be here to witness all of it hello good morning, good morning i'm good how are you i have a two bedroom two bathroom apartment it's like a luxury apartment i'm in a gated community i have a pool they have a jogging trail they have barbecue pits by the pool and stuff it's just it's amazing it's amazing. I actually like the whole community. Like the lady that I spoke to, she's really nice. Some of the apartments that I toured were kind of ghetto, but the lady, she just made it easy. And I don't know, I just really like the community. My sister wanted me to check her out of school because she wanted to come with me and see everything. And then she called me and told me that her head was hurting or her stomach was hurting or something just to be extra. Like, girl, I'm coming to get you. I'm going to come get you. I also want to stop and get some Starbucks because because the Starbucks in this area is not close to my apartment so I'm probably not gonna be going to this Starbucks as much or as frequently as I was going so I'm just gonna stop by there and get my usual for the one time after I get everything settled in my apartment I'm probably gonna go grocery shopping and get some house supplies that I'm going to absolutely need and you know just get everything settled in I'm gonna need some cleaning supplies too so that I can clean everything down because when you're moving remember to wipe everything down because they they probably don't be wiping that stuff down so if you want to be safe and not have other people's germs definitely remember to wipe your apartment down i was gonna do some makeup today just so i can take like a little couple pictures but i don't think i feel like putting on makeup and my lashes are done so i'm gonna look cute either way i just gotta make sure my hair is done we're literally entering a new era the edges are done let me put my jacket on I am gonna put on a little sunscreen just to like make my face a little glowy. This black girl sunscreen is like the best. Let me show y'all what I look like. This is what we're looking like. I just have on this gray jacket, this little crop top, and some rib knit leggings. It's not like matchy matchy, but you know that's okay. I'm gonna go ahead and fold up like all of my blankets and put my pillows in bag. And then I'm also going to just put everything else up that needs to come with me. I literally have like bags and stuff in the hallway that they're gonna be taking. I'm gonna just go ahead and get all this stuff ready so that when I check my sister out of school and I go get Starbucks, I can come back they'll be here and they can start packing this stuff up okay guys so the movers actually came a little earlier and they got everything they packed up everything so we're about to go and get some starbucks really quickly before i go sign the lease and everything so let's get to it Okay, so we got caramel ribbon crunch frappuccinos. So freaking good. 
so freaking good. We got our ham and Swiss croissant. Mm -mm. How do you feel about me moving? Happy. You happy for me? Mm -hmm. Aww. I wanted you to cry. You want me to cry? Yeah, cry so I can feel good. <laughs> I can't cry. <laughs> now it's time to go to the apartment. I'm going to see you guys there. and stuff and then this is my living room we have a fireplace over here a lot of space we have high ceilings which is really nice and then if you come over here we have my patio very nice and spacious and then over here we have my kitchen even though i don't cook this is the sink you know we have the <laughs> this is the microwave oven and then this is my pantry with a lot of space to put a lot of stuff and then over here they actually gave me a welcome gift so they gave me some crackers chocolates they gave me some wine and then gave me paper towels a bar of soap some tissue some tie they got me a sprite and then some fabric softeners. Let's see your wine again, girl. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is the dishwasher. I'm gonna have to wipe everything down because they didn't clean it up very good. This is our refrigerator. We have an ice maker. I'm gonna have to clean this up too. You know, lots of space. Put food that she's not gonna cook. Laundry room, the washer, and the dryer, and then I have some space to put all of my laundry stuff. Let me turn off my light because I'm going to go high electric. Mm -mm, leave the light on. You left my light on. Left <laughs> it on all day, every day. No, keep them on. Keep the lights on. <laughs> Over here, this is the hallway. Then we have my guest bathroom. I think I want to change my light bulbs to white so it won't be so yellow in here. My favorite part of the bathrooms is like the garden tub. It's a really big tub and it's just really nice. So we got that. And then over here. Uh-uh, cut the light back on. You left my light for 18, 19 years. You left my lights on. I'm leaving every light on. As a matter of fact, let me put this down. I'm finna throw all my stuff, no. including my shoes. No shoes. <laughs> this is my guest bedroom. Cali room. This is not Cali's room. Look who in the room right now. Anyways, the movers actually came and put like all of my stuff in here. So yeah, this is like the storage room for now. The guest bedroom actually has a walk-in closet. Cali's room. Tour. The guest bed, the guest <laughs> closet is actually pretty spacious too. So if I ever run out of space in my closet, I can just use this closet. Over here we have a linen Keep closet. Yeah, I close it up to your room. This is not her room. <laughs> This is not her room. Over here is our linen closet. Probably put like all my towels and stuff in there. Then back here is the master's bedroom. This is my walk-in closet. A lot more space in here to put everything. I can put my shoes, my person. This is amazing. Over here, they have a little space right here where I think I'm probably gonna put like a vanity because it looks like the perfect spot to put a vanity. And then they put my bed up and stuff. I won't have to worry about that, but you know, it's a lot of space in here. And then I have the master's bathroom. They pretty much look the same. And then, you know, the garden tub. 
But yeah. Period. And period. Uh. <laughs> That's all. Y'all, we are in our own freaking place. I actually have some pretty good lighting from that way. Like if I was turned this way, the lighting would be immaculate. But like... I'm in my own apartment right now. Like this is so surreal. It feels so good. And I just cannot wait to like get all of my furniture and stuff and decorate because it's gonna be amazing. And right now it's like 3.45 ish. When Cameron gets here, we're probably gonna go to the store and get like some cleaning supplies and stuff because I wanna wipe everything down. I should have actually like wrote a list down of things that I need because I do probably need like a couple things to start in this apartment. I'm gonna need some towels and stuff. I'm gonna need some stuff probably for the bathroom so I can take a shower. I just have a lot to do. The main thing I want to do though is clean down everything so that I'll feel better when I put my own stuff in here. I can't believe it. This is high ceilings. High freaking ceilings, bro. I wrote this down in one of my manifestations. I have high ceilings. I have a pretty great view too. I don't know if y'all noticed like in my vlogs and stuff, I like to record me driving because the roads, like the highways, the architecture is just like very sightseeing for me like I like looking at that type of stuff and I literally have a view of like the bridge I don't know I have a fascination with bridges but um apartment i actually had to stop and go do one of my client's nails because i had a client on my move-in day camera helped me out a lot like he helped me wipe down you know the surfaces and stuff i finished cleaning the guest bathroom but i still have to clean my personal bathroom and i also want to clean the refrigerator and the dishwasher and then i should be done but my friends lauren and gabe are gonna come over we're actually gonna go to walmart and i'm gonna get a couple more things because i think i want to get some more towels I want to get some shower curtains and I want to get some floor mats so that, you know, I can actually take a shower and, you know, feel comfortable. What else do I need? Probably a couple of snacks and stuff so that I won't be, like, starving. Yeah, that's basically what we're going to do. I'm going to go ahead and try to clean up the bathroom. I'm going to hurry up and clean it before they get here because they should be here in about 10 to 20 minutes. So let me go ahead and do that real quick. Taking these drawers, I'm gonna be up until the morning. If it ain't your car, you just listen, so you don't own it. If I'm in the club, I got that fire on like a phone. And if I can't just paint me, then I'll burn us. Vibes be a little cute. They all on us. I'm from Atlanta where young niggas burn shit. I know they hating on me, but I don't read comments. Whenever I tell her to come, she burn me. Whenever it's smoke, my feet ain't burning. Too hot, I'm stuck too slow. I'm gonna fuck around the town. Off this way, I'm going all these shows. Even on the road, I'm gonna fuck around the town. I'm gonna fuck around the town. I'm gonna fuck around the town. 
master bathroom. Hopefully. I'm gonna straighten up the kitchen a little bit and then they should be on their way. Hey guys, we are trying to shop and literally it is Girl Funkies. Y'all can see that it's 1052, baby. Walmart closed at 11. I'm in here recording. Gary Brooke over here calculating. And then we got Miss YouTuber, Vipper. It's the way we trying to hurry up because we got seven minutes. <laughs> Y'all know it's bad. We're gonna start skipping. Okay, how much is it? Just $11. We had 29. Juice. Juice? Yeah, I'll probably get cranberry juice. Are you gonna get cranberry? What's here for me, Timber? I know you hate to see me go, but you love to see me walk away. Strut. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> oh, no. Nah. You could have left that at home, baby. You could have left that. And look, see, Negroes want to act like Negroes during Black History Month. You're supposed to act right. You're supposed to be pushing the buggy regular. It's Black History Month. Okay, guys, so we just came back from the grocery store. I'm about to put the groceries up. I just got some turkey bread. I just got some turkey bread, some milk, some cheese, some bread, cereal, and I got some um, snacks. I'm gonna show y'all later. Ah! Sorry. <laughs> Do you ever just say ouch, but it don't hurt? But nothing hurt? Yeah, like sometimes I can like. Just say it for no reason. Like, yeah, it's like, like a I safety. can probably bump into something. I'm like, ow, but like. It's like a safety word because you low key embarrassed. That may be true. You know what? If I'll be about to trip and fall, I'll be like, ouch. And it didn't even hurt. <laughs> Because you, know. you know it's about to hurt. I got some chips. I got these frosted flakes. And then I have some Nutri Grain bars. Okay, hey guys, I'm Gabe. <laughs> I'm just happy to be here. <laughs> okay, so if you uh -uh. don't know, I didn't introduce myself. I'm Lauren, the best out the group. Oh, girl. Please. Yeah. <laughs> We are Kyla's best friends, we're Miss Ariana, and we've been tasked to put Kyla's bathroom together. So today, we're gonna be handy man in this good old bathroom. He's gonna be doing all the work. <laughs> Lauren's gonna put this on the shower. Gabriel's gonna put this on the Kyle's thing for his bathroom is black and white. So, we're gonna take the things out of this here. We're gonna put our bathroom together. This is where you speed it up. Give her some time. And also, also she got a plunger because y'all know Kyle be blowing this toilet up, alright? Alright. Try me on these No tell me how you're lurking. Let me tell you something. If I don't get new music, <clears throat> sorry. If I don't get new music from Megan, from Nicki Minaj, from Sizzle, if you can hear me right now, this message is for you. Give me that deluxe album. 
or me and you gonna have some problems. We is done. Okay, so this is the bathroom. This is the shower curtain that it came with. That's the shower curtain that she got for her shower. There we're putting the soap. Black, bruh, you can't be missing. It's Black History Month. It came with the little bar soap thing for her toothbrush. Gave her waist and so we finna go see what Kyla doing. Y'all, she thinks she all that in a bag of chips because she go to the gym now. Watch this. You think you fine? Cause you been going to the gym consistently? Yeah. You think? Lately. People lose weight and just, ugh, they get on my nerves. Got my toothbrush and toothpaste. Let's see, let's see. Uh-oh, it look nice. Period and period. Uh. Back again, we just got out the bathroom. We in the bedroom. And now, we are about to put Kyla's bed together. Guys, it's literally been a couple of days. My sister actually spent the night last night and I actually moved my bed from that wall to this wall because I just think it looks so much better. Like it just fits right there. And instead of it blocking the window, it just looks so much better right there. So I just wanted to come on here and end off the video. Today, I'm actually about to be getting ready for a Mardi Gras ball. I'm literally so happy here, like so freaking happy. And just know there's gonna be a lot of apartment content coming out, so stay tuned tuned for that and I'm gonna see you guys in the next video.